Welcome you guys and welcome to an episode of Shenanigans. I'm Andy Duncan as you all know. We're still in Cape Town. This is basically the place And just hear how amazing that Nissan 350 or 370Z sounds that's coming up there. But today we're looking at this Lexus and all the cars that is basically around here. And just taking a vlog style through it and just looking what's in store and what Cape Town has to offer on day two of daily Driven XA and Sunanigans collab weekend. We're seeing some pretty epic cars today. So yeah, so back, relax and enjoy guys. Hi, my name is Abdul Aziz. I'm the owner of the V8 Lexus 3UZ 4.3 liter Isuzu Bucky. We did the engine swap on here because I love a V8, I love the sound of a V8. And we sprayed it candy apple red. The base color is silver mixed with a bit of bronze with the candy over there. It's a mission to spray it, but I mean, if you get it right, you will get the end result. Along at the back, we have a matching bike, which is the BMW S1000 RR, which is tuned, extended as well. Uh, we got the extensions on the back, and that's basically what you see is what you get. The suspension we also upgraded, we put in the Hilux hubs and uh, it's also the Yota links at the back or the shaft should I say that goes into the diff so we managed to get it from six hole to five hole because the wheels on there is much more accessible so that's basically what you see it's running Spetronics management and it's running the 21 or gearbox and it works fine for now until we break something because you know everyone wants to play and things like that we did it manual because manual is much more exciting for me you can go dsg but i mean it's preference to ever so that's basically what i have done here C the lowered really looks amazing and you don't normally see these type of cars that's lowered and basically looking apart because normally you just see your VWs or your BMs or your normal type of stand top cars but this is just something else and it looks amazing they obviously see seeing David vlogging there as well looking at this crazy bucket that's standing here that's also looking insane and just to say how this bucket is like lowered and just how the bucket looks it just looks amazing and insane and i must say this really looks amazing so yeah guys we are heading out to Sierras. we enjoyed the day thoroughly in cape town uh met up with a bunch of people uh had nice conversations nice networking but we're heading back to Sierras now to devil to do devil's car um pretty excited to see what the r is going to be capable of and also the nice person devil is and just comparing the two cars and to see what the differences are like the r has got four wheel drive my car has got two wheel drive or basically um, if you have the limited slip diff in the car you have two wheel drive but more or less the motors are the same just a couple of year and eight weeks on the R's and uh, normal sevens motors but pretty excited to see what the car is going to do today so yeah let's head out to see us and let's enjoy the R today Today we're featuring Diewald's car. This is Diewald's car standing in the back. Call 7R. Like I told you, this and my car is mostly the same. Uh, both of them, Diewald can correct me if I'm wrong. Both of them got IS38 turbos on now. I think 
the R has only got bigger brakes on and it's also got bigger injectors and a couple of bits and pieces on this motor that makes it different but we're gonna explain to you later on in the video basically what's the differences and what is more like uh, if you like basically drive it on a four-wheel drive system like how you feel and how the car basically just pulls away compared to the normal GTI so yeah guys sit back relax and enjoy so yeah guys we're back in Muscle Bay uh, had a good weekend with 2Z Nation, Liberable, Bad Productions and all the guys DDSA who see me rocking the DDSA merch today I must say the car handled it pretty pretty sweet but some minor things I have to touch up on the car that I will be revealing in the next videos and basically some minor tweaks that I have to do underneath the engine bay but coming back to the weekend that we had in Cape Town I must say the guys opened up their doors 2Z Nation, Liberable and Weird Productions I must say guys thank you for an awesome day that we had to spend with each other looking through the Runnexes going through all the cars and just doing what we love to showcase our cars and the passion that we have for cars I mean you guys took us through so much on that day and just thank you to all for allowing us to go through your cars looking at your cars and I must say your cars are pretty pretty sweet and epic really looking forward to coming up to you guys again doing a collab with you guys again and just going through the cars that you have I mean there's some sweet cars and I'm really looking forward to that and to Liberable I mean one of the pioneers in the industry we had to, a couple of words and I mean we speak a lot on the phone and I'm just looking to do it looking forward to doing a collab with you as well and our two red productions what can I say the guy is also a pioneer and very down-to-earth guy and willing to swap ideas and just how the industry is at the moment so I'm looking forward to coming to all you guys again doing collabs and just enjoying and networking with you guys and to my brother David of DDSA will be seen rocking the merch thank you for always having me thank you for the hospitality and thank you for always having my back it really means a lot I'm really looking forward to coming to see us again seeing the cars doing what we do doing what we love and I mean I see you guys have some pretty nice wonders I see some new VVLs there some uh, MK1 so there's some sweet cars still to do in Sierra so I'm looking forward to coming to Sierra again guys so all that's left to say is guys do protect yourselves to look after yourselves have a blessed week and new merch will be available very very soon so I'm pretty pretty excited for that and the MK1 seven is gonna be in the next video so we're gonna do a couple of minor tweaks on this car i think you guys are gonna love what you're gonna have to do to this car and we're also gonna have a draggy video of the car so yeah guys be blessed be safe and enjoy